Mary Ainsworth, a development psychologist, is well known for her work in infant attachment. She created a strange situation, which is an experiment testing attachment theory and examining the reaction of an infant to different stimuli. Here we have 11 month old Nico. We are observing how he is reacting to this unfamiliar setting. How will he act towards a stranger? What will happen when he is left alone? Or when the mother is reunited with the child? We are looking for the type of balance that a child has between an attachment to meet and to explore the materials around him. Now that Nico has settled down to play, a stranger comes in and starts interacting with him. As you can see, Nico is quite unsettled with the stranger. Soon after the mom leaves the room and Nico stays to play with the stranger, Nico does not interact with the stranger, but he also does not cry for the mother to come back. Some other infants would be distressed and may even cry for their mother to come back. Nico is expressing a form of distress by not playing with the stranger or the toys. On this occasion, Nico will not want Jess's embrace or wanting to play with her on the next stage. Jess now comes back to the room to play with Nico. This is called the reunion. But unlike other infants who would cry for their mother's embrace, Nico does not seek the mom at all. Now approaching stage five, the mother will leave and we will get to see Nico's reaction. Nico shows distress by looking back at the door several times, then finally Nico starts to cry. The stranger now comes in and tries to comfort the child. Nico does not playfully interact with her, but he also does not cry for the mother's return. Once Nico saw his mother coming in the room, he instantly calls for her. But once he gets picked up, he does not interact with the mom. Nico shows an ambivalent attachment toward his mother. Nico expresses signs of distress when Jess leaves, but does not cry for her. But Nico avoids a stranger. found from our first attempt in the experiment that the door being closed or open increases the infant's reaction and distress. Therefore, from doing the experiment, the infant validates Mary Ainsworth's original findings, that based on attachment theory, infants react to separation and reunion with loved ones.